。每次走过熟悉的街道，你和昨天还在这里停靠。那么多扇温暖的窗口，哪一个能收留我的微笑？曾经多少泛黄的美好，任由季节的风去平调，已经戒了往事的味道，我的心不会没。I've arrived. Lifestyle. I can't. I can't see Harper's Bazaar. All right, I got it. World military affairs. Mr. Gong. Hello, I'm Gong Jian. Are you Miss Dong? <laughs> I'm Deng Cao Cao. Really nice to meet you. Well, I doubt that. You're late, you know. Yes. Something happened. I encountered a very ill-mannered driver on my way here. He splashed water on my clothes and then sped up and ran away. The heel of my shoe also broke. I came here regardless of what. Are you referring to me? What car do you drive? An SUV. What color? Black.
Hi, sir. What's up? Hello? Well, did you meet her? Yeah, we met all right. Then put Lee Wen's, Lee Wen's uh, friend on the phone. Quickly now, I'm curious. Uh, sir, uh, she just, she just went, she just went to the bathroom. Hey, you little turd. Don't you lie to me. Don't you dare covertly oppose my orders, or I will make things hard for you. I wouldn't dare. Don't worry. I'm taking this seriously. Did you take her to lunch? Oh, um, we're having lunch soon. Remember, pay the bill. Yes, sir. Look at you. You're such a busybody. I have no choice. It was our daughter who abandoned him. Hello. Hi. I just bought these shoes, but I don't want them. I want to return them. Here's the receipt. No problem. Just a moment. Thanks. Miss, here's your refund. Please take it. Thank you. Why are you following me? Don't you feel a little bit awkward? How am I supposed to feel? Hey! Hey! You bought me these things, so they're mine now. I can do what I want with them. Do you want the money back? Don't be angry. I didn't ask for the cash. You can do what you want with it. But I still have to please some people. And I could really use your help. What kind of help? I promised the person who set us up that I'd buy you lunch. <laughs> Have lunch? Okay. I'm a little hungry now. Ah, over there. The food there is pretty good. Let's go. Let's go. I think this place looks good. Hmm? Soup here is tasty. When you finish, you can get a refill for free. I don't eat mutton. Can you order me something else? Cabbage and tofu stew.
Please, watch my things. Hello? Hello, sir. Uh, I bought you a pair of wool slippers. Are you home? I can bring them to you. Um, I'm not. At home right now. I'm at a bar. I don't know when I will be home. How about tomorrow? Gong Jian has really, really gone too far. He splashed water on you and fed you such a plain food. But you still won. In such a short time, you got 4,000 yuan from him. Do you know how rude he was? He really deserved what he got. All in all, he was pity, hideous, hateful, and impolite. All of that, a real negative attitude. Just terrible. But the Gong Jian I know is not like that. How could he act this way? Don't worry. When I see him again, I'll teach him a lesson for you. Never mind. Hey, I did what you asked, right? Did you get me a job? Oh, yeah. Sun Nanwei has already done it, so I'll take you with me next Monday. Remember, get to know the job well. It might help you find your son. Wonderful. Thanks a lot. This is my treat. You're very welcome. I'll order something. Expensive. Sir, chicken wings, please. Your old boss sets you up with a date, and your attractive assistant wants to send you slippers. Seems that women are throwing themselves at you. So it seems, right? But I don't have patience for it now. Hey, I think your assistant is kind of cute. Consider it. The most stupid thing in the world is to mix business with pleasure. <sighs> How about... Mixing pleasure with business. That's worse. <laughs> That's why I'm still single. <laughs> <laughs> if she didn't work for you, would you ask her out? Maybe, I guess. I don't know. I've never thought about it. Right now, I don't have any... any feelings for women. Yeah, feelings for men? You know me. <laughs> don't scare me. You gave me goosebumps. Get ready. <clears throat> to be honest, Shari is an ideal. She's intelligent and has been working for me for years. She's devoted and is very good to me. I'm not a rock. I also have urges and feelings. But I'm just not sure. I'm not sure about my feelings. Not sure if we would be suited or if I'm attracted to her. If you're not sure whether you're suited or attracted to her, then you can just try to meet other women. If you then have feelings for her after dating another woman, 
And congrats. You're in love. Hey, Katusha. So pretty. Won't be long. Give me a minute. What do you think? You're dating Western girls? Katusha. She's a great pianist. You want to meet her? Let's go. Let's talk with her. Come on. Wait, wait, wait. Huh? Listen to me. Today, you should choose sit here and drink with me or go out with her after I leave. You got oh, me? I'm good with her. This is on him. Hey, where are you off to? Aren't you going there? How could I? I like men too. <laughs> Spare keys are for an emergency. Jogging, huh? Why are you here? I came to give you the slipper that I wanted to give you yesterday when you were out drinking. You can take them to our office. Why bother bringing them here? You're not in the office much now, and my place is pretty close. Why didn't you go in? You have a key, right? It's so cold here. It's a spare key. Spare keys are for emergencies only. Let me, let me. Thank you. They're made of wool from Australia. Very warm. Try them on. If they don't fit, I'll change them. Oh, uh, it's okay. They're fine. Is this your laundry? I'll wash it for you. Hey, no, no, no. Um, I think you should get to the office right now. You're not going there? Yeah, sure. Let's go together. <sighs> together? To Hello? Hey, sir. How are you? Gong Jin. You're out of line. When you date a girl, even if you can't show enthusiasm, you should at least act like a gentleman. Not only were you rude, but you also splashed water on her. Muddy water, too. You're really out of line. You took her to lunch, but you just ordered her mutton soup. She hasn't eaten such things since childhood. Why couldn't you offer her what she likes? I'm telling you, if you keep this up, you'll never get a wife. We're done talking. <laughs> the villain complains first. Boss. This coat can't be washed by water. I can get it dry cleaned. Oh, no, no. Just throw it away. Why? It seems so expensive. I'm going to take it to a dry cleaner. Oh, I left the laundry in your washing machine. Hang them up when they're done. I'll head to work now. It's okay to blame him, but why get so angry with him? Yeah, uncle. No need to be mad at him. There's one thing I don't understand, though. Gong Jian runs a big company. How can he be so cheap? It's not that he's cheap. He just wants this thing to fail. I knew it. What? What does he want? To remain single all his life? You need to talk some sense into him. If he want to be single, then let him. Here, Uncle. Eat an apple. I just peeled mm. it. Uncle, Gong Jian's company is hiring a legal team. Would you please do me a favor and recommend Sun Don Wei's law firm for me? Want me to pull strings? 
No way. Wow, 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 wow. You look so elegant. Definitely shadows Feng Shangxiang. Perfect. <laughs> Why should I shadow her? It's my first day, so I'm wearing formal clothes. Is that okay? Of course it is. You look beautiful whatever you wear. Don't worry about others. Just be yourself. Let's go. Welcome, welcome. I uh, welcome Without saying, of course I'll take good care of your friend. Okay. <laughs> good news. Good news. No way. A big order. It's in Shangri-La. Isn't this the courier who lost my package last time? Uh. uh <laughs> oh. This is Miss Dong Xiaoqiao. She's starting today as Nanwei's assistant. Uh, uh, Zheng Sheng, let me uh introduce again. Didn't I say uh, that I wanted to hire an assistant before? This is the assistant I hired. Uh, Ding Cao Cao, Cao Cao, this is my partner, Lawyer Feng, Feng Shao Sheng. Hello, I'm sorry for losing your package. I hope I can make amends. You're the one who has a law degree. Who got married after graduation, but was abandoned by her husband because you lost your. Uh, oh yeah, all right. Uh, I uh, have something important to deal with. Uh, you guys uh, talk. Go ahead. What level are you at? I haven't passed the judicial exam. You wasted your education. You're qualified, but with no experience. How can you do this job? <laughs> Sheng Xiang, she's not going to be your assistant. Why do you care about this? I'm afraid that a novice like her will ruin the reputation of the firm. Rest assured, I'll work very hard. Fine, you can intern first. A three-month probation and basic wage. Be clear of your position. Coming to work dressed like that, you're not the boss. Cruel. Don't mind her. Oh yeah, Miss Jo, please get us the information about the lawyer firm of Bay Owl Real Estate. This is a good opportunity for you to impress us. Don't worry, I always know what I'm doing. What are you talking about? I'll tell you later. Come on, sit down. That Gongjian you set me up with last time. He works for Bao, doesn't he? Of course. He's been working since he left the army. It's his friend's company. <sighs> Why didn't you tell me before? I really shouldn't have offended him. Hey, why mix your personal life with work? I was trying to find you a boyfriend, not looking to get information. It's okay that you didn't like him much. Hey, if only Sun Nanwei's former partner was still working here. Getting this done would be a piece of cake for him. He's a very well-known and capable lawyer. Then where did he go? He had a stroke. 
So Sun Nanwei and Feng Xiangxiang are the premier partners right now. I was hoping that my uncle could swing some doors, but he was reluctant to do so. Since I'm part of this company now, I should share some of the responsibility. Give Gong Jian's number to me again. I remember I gave it to you. Deleted it. I didn't think I'd need it. Here. Don't save it. Call him now. I'll call him. Wait. Wait. Hello? Hey, Mr. Gong. Hello. This is Dong Cao Cao. Do you remember me? Dong Cao Cao? I remember. What's up? Sorry about last time. You're a good guy. I hope you'll forgive me. Let me buy you dinner. To make it up to you? Buy me dinner? Let's choose where through messages. Bye bye. <laughs> well done. That's my girl. Come in, please. Sir, mm. what's the matter? Uh, uh, do you have the receipt for the coat that you sent to the dry cleaner? Yes, I have it, and I can get the coat here for no you No need. Too. Just give me the receipt. I'll get the coat myself. Okay. Mm. Nice car. Thanks. So why do you want to buy me dinner? I realized you're nice. Nice person or nice car? Both are nice. <laughs> you changed your mind quickly. Only one day passed, and now you like me? No. Then what do you mean? Oh, I know. You left your coat with me last time. Don't worry, I've washed it. It's in the trunk. You don't need to buy me dinner because of that. Help me out by taking it away. Why are you reading so much into this? I just think you're... Sure. You apologized. Sincerely, I think. Why not? What should we eat? You decide. As long as it's not sheep bone soup. What's wrong with you, exactly? What do you mean? Why are you so stubborn? You took me to another mutton place. Then what's wrong with you exactly? Why do you hate mutton so much? I was born in the year of the sheep. That's why I don't eat sheep. Oh, I'm a tiger. I like eating sheep. Be aware. So what then? You want to eat me? Okay. So, you bought me dinner. And apologized to me as well. You can go home. Hey! That's a little rude. Why? How can you be so cold-hearted? I'm a girl, and it's pretty late. You want me to take a taxi? What do you want to do? Can't you drive me home? Will you get a flat tire? Where do you live? Willow Town. Where? Willow Town! Get in. It's not my parking space, but I park here every day. I park There's here no every day. There's no enough parking spaces. Move your first car. First come, first served. There's so many spaces. Why do you have to park here? Can't you I park blind? somewhere else? There are no other spaces. Is the property management here always like this? There aren't enough spaces for everyone. 
People often fight over the spots. Property management and security are pretty useless. Stop here. This is it. Which floor? Why do you ask? You want to come up? Do you want to invite me or what? I wasn't thinking to. Neither was I. <sighs> oh. Yeah. You work for Bayal now, right? Are you hiring a legal team? You know, I work for Shangwei Law Firm. Would you perhaps consider us for that job? So that's the real reason that you asked me out for dinner. Yeah. That okay? We should really be friends, Mr. Gong. Sure. Thank you then. Hey, Sarah, I passed by Willowtown. I found that the property management really poor. Listen, tell our property management department to take a look and notify Willowtown. It's our model project, so it's very important. All right, that's it. yet. I'm watching the snow. Why did you come down? Because I noticed you're still here. Here. It's the first snow of the year. Let's drink to it. But I shouldn't. I've got to drive. Call for the driving service. Or you can park here. Huh? Where should I stay then? Are you trying to drop a hint? Are you seducing me? <laughs> I didn't know you were so weak. Sometimes I am. For example? Now, for example. <sighs> it is romantic now. If only there was some music. You really don't want some? I just want a taste. Then you're not gonna drive? I will. It's just a taste.
Sir, you can't park here. You've blocked the road. Please move your car. How can you come to work, dressed like that? You said I dressed up too much last time. That's why I wore simple clothes. Well, simplicity isn't the same as leisure. You need to dress appropriately. You should look professional. Shang Shang, you're being so difficult. You told her not to wear suits last time. This time she's dressed casually, but you're still not happy. How about this? Don't let her wear anything. I am mourning. Uh, Li Wen, uh, did you, uh, did you miss me? <laughs> you wish. Mr. Gong, are you seeing someone? Why do you say that? I guessed. Is she the owner of the coat which I sent to the dry cleaner? Have you sent the development plan of who I want to manage Lu? Yes, I have. I'll use it in today's meeting. Uh huh. What do you think of Lu Xiaochong? He's pretty nice. I also think he's pretty nice. He's handsome, and went to a good university. I thought maybe you guys could hang out sometime. Thanks for your concern. You should all thank me. This weekend, Dongfang Commercial College is holding a party for its third anniversary. I got us all invitations. Oh! You should really use this opportunity and try and publicize the law firm. Well, I've heard of it before. It's a networking event, and the attendees are from very high-profile businesses. You've done really well. You've even got <laughs> invitation cards. Li Wen still cares about me. She still does. Cut the crap. It's because I care about Sao Tao. Oh. Look, Sao Tao. <sighs> I've got the complete name list of all the guests attending the event. Through a thorough investigation of their background information, and remember it. You should match their name and their faces. Remember this: don't talk about business when you first meet them. You should try to befriend them and then move on to the next step. Understand? There's so many of them. She doesn't have enough time for that. Let's split it: twenty people each. Li Wen, can you do us another favor and be our external help? Is that okay?、Uh, I'm very busy, you know. Please, Li Wen, please help us. If the firm goes bankrupt, it will be our son who will suffer because of this. You're so helpless.
就是来得太迟。风把头发吹乱，习惯自己梳理，按下手机按键，只能打给自己。幸福，下一个定义。大地是一起缩小，一起承担风。